packed up. Got packed up early today because I got in a little early. It's like 7:24, so I got packed up, filled up. Finished kind of early. Got room in the back. Got a lot of room in the back left over. So yeah, hopefully this will be an early day. We'll see. Let's go. Don't play with it, don't play with it, don't play with it, don't play with it, don't play with it. What is good, yo? What is good? Tuesday morning, man. Rise and grind. Top of the top. Top of the young. Top of the young. Top of the talking about. What's up, man? Get your ass up. Get your ass up, man. I am out, man. I'm out of the warehouse early. It's like 7.30, man. I got there a little early, got all packed up, as you can see back there. Now I am gone, man. This is about the earliest I've been left in a long time. Because I was like, man, let me get there early. Let me pack up. Let me be gone. And then I can stop and get me something to eat. And I ain't worried about the time. So, yeah, man, I'm out here, man. I'm out here. I'm leaving the warehouse now. Uh, it's going to be a great day. First of all, it's going to be a great day. A number of positivity my way. I'm speaking it into existence. Nothing but positivity. I stiff on the negativity. You're tuned into the Rehab Center TV. I am your host, uh, Go Time Delivery. Because guess what? It is always go time, man. Always go time. For real, for real, for real, man. Hey, man. Is the cargo van business overrated? Is the cargo van business overrated? Oh. Uh, a lot of people probably say yes. I'm going to say no. It's all in what you make it. It's all in what you make it, man. If you do let it do what it do, it's going to do it, man. Hey, so it's all about your um, tenacity. It's all about the energy that you put into it. It's all about the confidence that you have in yourself. Because for me, it is not overrated. I'm out here getting money. I'm out here getting money. So it's not overrated for me, man. But, hey, a lot of people say it is. Hey, man, it's all of what you put into it, man. It's all of what you're looking to do, man. So it's not overrated to me. I'm out here getting it, man. I'm not complaining. This is a lot better than that 9 to 5 job I had while I was sitting in front of that computer every day. Going to those meetings every week. So it's good. I, I enjoyed it. It is freedom for me. Smell that? That is called Freedom. That's called freedom, man. And if you want to get into this business, man, just know that you got to put all your efforts into it. If you don't put your efforts into it, hey, you can think it's overrated. And you ain't going to like what you're getting out of it. So put all your efforts into everything that you do, man. Not just the cargo business. Everything. And you will win. W-I-N. Win. We out here winning, man. A lot of people out here winning. A lot of people are not complaining. Stop complaining. Get the grinding and get the hustling. Get the shuffling. That's what it's going to take. It's all about you. Everybody's experience is different. It's all about that effort that you put into it, man. So, no, for me, the cargo van business is not overrated. This is one of the best things I've done in a minute. One of the best decisions I have made. I have looked for a lot of different things to make money for the man. I didn't, I didn't, I didn't press. He, I didn't bought a heat press, selling clothes. I didn't, I didn't had like three or four vending machines in di different locations. But it ain't like this, man. I'm telling you, it's definitely worth it if you put the effort into it. That's all I'm gonna say. Absolutely. So, man, hey, man, let's go out there. Let's go out there and get that money. Let's go out there and be positive. Let's go out there and hustle, man. Because once you assume the position of power, people soon give it to you. Remember that. Once you assume the position of power, people soon give it to you. That means boss up. Boss up. If you ain't bossing up, man, then that's it's on you. That's on you. Let me tell you that. 
So, man, I am out, man. I'm headed to um, Chick-fil-A. Then I'm headed to my first stop, man. It is 7.35 in the a.m. It is, what is it? Is it, is it Wednesday? Then it ain't Wednesday, right? Tuesday, Wednesday, one of the days, man. Hey, man, I done lost track, man. I done lost track. Yeah, it's Tuesday. It's Tuesday. I wish it was Wednesday, but I ain't trying to rush the days, man. Um, God bless uh, thank God for allowing me to see another day. If you're watching this, thank God for allowing you to see another day. Now, let's go get money. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, share the content. Also, hit that notification bell and subscribe, man. Subscribe. What's wrong with y'all? All right, man, I'm gone. <laughs>
coming in hot, man. Ooh. Man, I can't wait to get my partition, man. I should have a, another couple more weeks. He said he was going to order and then he's going to get at me when he got there. So, yeah, man. Once I get that partition, man, it's going to be on and popping. Yeah. But, yeah, man, that's what it is. I'm at my next stop. People are urgent care. The Harbor Freight is right over here in, in, the, in the shopping plaza. I'm going to holler back at you. Like, comment, subscribe. Share the content, man. Subscribe, man. Subscribe. You feel me? Hit the notification bell. You feel me? And let me tell you what's overrated. What's overrated is you think you're just going to jump into this business and you're just going to get paid. That's overrated. If you think that you're going to jump in this business and get paid, get paid, get paid, that's overrated. Because that ain't going to come without you doing the work. So if you think you're going to jump in this business and get paid without putting the blood, sweat, and tears in, hey, guess what? It ain't going to happen. You being lazy, not doing your due diligence, not doing your own research, that's overrated. That's overrated. Do your own research. Don't come onto YouTube and ask somebody a million questions without you first doing the research. Don't depend on nobody else to give you the answers. That's what I didn't do. I pretty much I got the game from YouTube. But best believe I did my own research. I went in and I did my own digging trying to find the answers. I didn't rely on nobody else to give me the answers. Now, if I'm looking at videos and they, they provide the answers that I'm looking for, that's that's great. But if they didn't, I'm going to look for those answers somewhere else. I'm going to do my own research. So you jumping into this business thinking you're going to get paid without doing your own due diligence, that is overrated. Because it ain't going to happen like that at all. Best believe that. You got to be serious. You got to want to do it. You got to be willing to invest in yourself. Because you're going to spend some change. You're going to spend some money. Best believe. So, man, if you're serious about it, man, do your research, man. If you're serious about it, do your research, do your due diligence to try to find the answers that you're looking for. Because there is definitely light at the end of the tunnel if you put in the work. Let me tell you that. There's definitely happiness if you put in the work. So man, yeah, baby, and by me saying that, don't 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 hesitate to ask me questions. Cause if you ask me questions, I'm definitely gonna answer them if I know the answer. But if I don't know the answer, I'm gonna research and look for those answers. And that's what you should do as well, man. Come on, man. Let's all get money together, man. Let's all be happy together. Let's all be our own bosses together, man. We can do it, man. We can do it. I wish nothing but the best for you. As long as you put in the work to be better. Because it ain't going to happen without that. Let me tell you. Let me tell you. That money coming to you without you doing the work is overrated. It ain't going to happen. And that's what it is, man. Now what I'm dreading right now, let me tell you what I'm dreading. This is what I'm dreading. I'm dreading I have four, at least four stops in the mall. Oh my God. I hate, hate, hate going to the mall. Mainly because the security guard. But I hate going to the mall, man. I hate delivering to the mall with a passion, for real. But it's on my route, so I gotta do it, man. So I'm gonna do it. But best believe he's gonna have to help he's gonna have to catch me and tell me to use the freight elevators. But that's what it is, man. I'm about to pull up to the mall now. I see it right now. Hey, you know what irks me a little bit? I go to the same place pretty much every day and deliver there. And they have a security guard. Now she's nice. Security, she, security guard, she, she's definitely a nice person. But every day I go in there, 
I follow her because she has to open the door. But every day she directs me to where I need to put um, my merchandise at. I mean the inventory at for for um, the people who order it. Every day she comes in there and she said, put it right there. Now the thing about this is, is that it's always in the same place. So you think that after I've been there for 25, 30 times, she doesn't feel that she has to tell me every time I go in there where to put it at. I know this by now. I be wanting to say something to her, like, lady, you don't have to keep t pointing and tell me where to put it at. I know where to put it at. Like, come on, man. What? I, nobody's slow here. I don't know. I guess that's part of her muscle memory or something. She just has to tell me where to put it at. Lady, I know where to put it at. Just finished my route, gotta thank God. I don't know, but the day seems kinda odd. No barking from the dog, no smoke, and mama cut the breakfast with no hog. I am finished. Your boy is done. Stick a fork in him, cause he is done. I am done with my route, man. Yeah, uh, 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 uh. But I still got my 430 pickup. I gotta make that extra money. I gotta get that extra money. Yeah, man, that 430 pickup is extra money for me. That's why I do it. That's the only reason I do it. But I'm done for the day, man. It's a good day, man. The sun out, it's shining. The sun decided to uh, make an appearance. Thank you for finally coming outside. Yeah, man, but it's all to the good, man. It's all to the good. But, man, like I was saying, man, is the cargo van business overrated? And I say no, it is not. And I explained why earlier. The cargo van business is not overrated. If somebody told you that, they lied. If somebody told you that and had a bad experience, that's because they didn't put enough grind in it. They ain't put enough hustle in it. They ain't put enough tenacity in it. You gotta go down deep and dig and dig and dig and dig, man. For real. Cause it's been good to me. The game's been good to me. The game's been good to me so far. The game's been good to me. It's up to par. The game been good to me. You feel me? Hey, man, I hope y'all had a great day. I had a great day, man. Another day of getting money. I am thankful for the opportunity to be able to get out here every day and get money. If you're trying to get into this business, man, start saving up to get you a cargo van, get you a Sprinter van, um, whatever and get busy because the money is out here the money is out here if you're a paper chaser if you're a paper chaser go chase that money just make sure you catch it just make sure you catch it man but yeah like i said great day another opportunity tuesday is in is in the books it's a wrap Reynolds. Yes, sir. Now I'm headed to Kroger's to pick up my empty totes from the pharmacy. And then I'm headed to my 430 pickup. Then once I grab that, I'm going to the, drop that off at the warehouse. I got a, I got a return. I got one. Um, the, the office wasn't open. I went there in the morning about 9.30. The office wasn't open. So I'm not going all the way back over there. We'll try it again tomorrow. We'll try it again tomorrow. I just go over there about 10 o'clock tomorrow. A little bit later. But man, if y'all got any questions, man, comment below. Comment below. Say hello. Hello. Yeah, man. Like, comment, subscribe, share the content. If you know anybody interested in the in the um, the Sprinter van, 
cargo van, business, route running, gig apps. Holla at me, man. Tell them to holla at me. Tell them to go ahead and subscribe to the channel, man. The Rehab Center TV, you are tuned in. Go time delivery, because guess what? It is always go time. So yeah, man, if you're interested in um, get with Curry Express too, man. Curry Express, y'all gotta start paying me for this, giving y'all this plug. Go to CurryExpress.net. CurryExpress.net. 